everybody and welcome back to the channel. It's your friendly neighborhood farmer Raznak. We are back on Susquehanna River Valley doing a little contract work. That's right, we got some field work. We've been hired out by Full Throttle Farms, also known as Mr. Farmer Klein. He's went ahead and hired us up for a little little job involving fertilizer. That's what he wants us to do. He wants us to put fertilizer on a few of fields. In fact, we need to be doing fields 134, 35, 36, 37, 39, and 19. 132 looks like it needs fertilizer, but that wasn't in the list of things that he wanted done. So we're not going to spray more than he asks for. So again, like I said, we got these fields down here we need to knock out and then field 19 needs to be sprayed we're in our good old handed dandy big john deere 49 40 with the big boom and yeah just put down some fur put down some fertilizer on the fields we need got to keep track of uh of how much we used because he'll be paying for that along with $100 per acre. So like a prime example is this field is, field 135 is 6.23 acres. So this is $623 for us to spray, which isn't bad. It's actually really good for us because this, this bad boy, it books along uh, pretty quick. She is a fast one. That is for sure, 21 miles per hour. Not bad at all. Did we miss a spot? I feel like we missed a spot there. I'm like working on my timing to get my timing down just right. There we go. And I'm sure eventually he'd probably have a spray herbicide too. We'll see what happens. We'll see what kind of gigs, what kind of jobs he gives us. I haven't got a whole lot of work from the other players lately. Uh, it's just been Farmer Klein that hired me out. That's it. I've, I've, I haven't done uh, I haven't done much in the last few days because I've been waiting for waiting for jobs. But then again, it is it is mid spring still, it's still very early because it, this is a 24 day season, so it is very very early. And um, I don't expect people to have a tons of work for me. I also have another job for Farmer Climb, which is some animal transport, which that will be in the next video. We'll be doing some animal transport in the next video, if I can get that recorded. I Every now and then I will skip a job here and there, um, just because sometimes I do it, um, it's kind of like a spur of the moment thing, where I'm contacted to come do a job before I am uh, I'm ready to like set up and record uh, or it's like at a time where it's not quiet where I'm at maybe my kids are down here in the gamer den you know I might just be playing just hanging out so those every now and then invoice will be skipped these things do happen yeah that's what's going on I, I put out a price list I actually priced everything on the map I figured out the cheapest way to do stuff the least expensive way to do stuff to buy and um, I put that out so hopefully the other players will see it and maybe contract me to do um, not only work for them but also uh, the cost of services or goods because that is important prime example is a uh, seed on the map seed on the map is very expensive uh, the cheapest you can get it from actually is from the shop at 90 cents per liter but i actually own the seed factory over here this bad boy and i buy wheat i buy barley i buy oh, i buy pretty much every crop almost every crop put it in there and i get seed and i can turn around and sell the seed for 60 cents a liter and not only do I make money, but the players pay less for seed, so they can they can seed their plants, they can seed seed their fields at a better rate. So it's a win-win for everybody. I just got to get them cued into the fact that I have it. Somebody's been down here making hay. He must have been making hay down here, because all of his grass is cut. 
trying to maximize my usage and still cover um, cover his fields to the best of my ability without charging him too much for fertilizer. I need the mod that turns these this off. There's actually a mod that you can use with this sprayer where you can actually turn um, you can turn stuff off. Like you can uh, you can only have so many nozzles on, which is pretty cool. I need I need that mod. That way we can uh, we can actually um, control how many how many how many nozzles we got spraying, different stuff like that. It is early 7:03. I thought it'd just be a good little episode to record, kind of show you where we're at here. I'm gonna have to reload the sprayer, and here's the my problem is is I, I brought the sprayer down and I didn't bring an extra tank. I need an extra tank. But this, this sprayer doesn't have a hitch at all. So I don't know how I'm going to do that. I don't know the best way of, of carrying on. Because I really don't want to buy a big giant tanker full of fertilizer because I don't have anywhere to put it. I guess I could put fertilizer storage at the yard. I'm going to have to. I'm just going to have to eventually put different storages down. And there it is. Field 135 and 136 are finished. We'll go knock out 137 and 139. Real quick, we'll just go... Oh, control S. Just flip our course. There we go. Do a 190. And if you don't know what I just did with GPS, if you hit go into Control S and you go to this little thing, you can actually flip your course 90 degrees. That's how I like to do it usually. I don't really save courses because you actually can go into GPS and save all kinds of courses. Like you can make a whole list of them, give them different names and tracks and different line methods there's a there's different stuff you can do yeah we're gonna have to refill our uh, refill our sprayer and I, I was looking earlier and there's there's not really like a small tank you know it's not a small tank that I can use that's really what I need is just like a small tank that carries this little universal tank does. No, C3. I could buy a little truck, but I don't want to buy a truck just to carry it. I mean, if I'm going to buy it. Uh, this 82 Logistics. See, like this one right here. It's just. This must, it has to carry other stuff. Surely it carries other stuff. It says multi-product tank, but right here it only says it carries a little. We might get that one. We'll try it out here in just a minute. What's the worst that can happen, right? <laughs> oh, Raz. Actually, let's turn GPS off. We're going to freehand this one. Field's so small, we should be okay. But yeah, it's a... Uh, I need a little tank to put on the pickup truck that I can bring over here real quick. That's what I want to do. I mean, you can see, like, I just... These fields just get knocked out so fast. His fields are kind of small, though. So it makes sense that they get... They get finished quickly. Oh my. That's a little lag. My tractor just did a little sw swig and swiggle. Just a little whoop but whoop a doo. Yeah, because I'm not going to have enough fertilizer to do all of his fields. I drove down here 32 miles an hour all the way down here on the 4X, which wasn't horrible, but still wasn't the fastest in the world.
Man, this is this is easy. Easy money. <laughs> oh, easy money. I can see why people invest in these things. I mean if in real life it it I mean if you can cover this much ground with this big thing, holy cow. I haven't used this much. I used it some uh, on Nebraska lands, or a version of. This is actually uh, the version that's in the in-game mod hub. You can get this. Because there for a while it wasn't available. You couldn't get this rig on... Uh, it just wasn't there. It wasn't there to get. On the in-game mod hub, you actually had to... I think it was a Facebook group that had it. For the longest time, Buster's Modding had one, but it was a uh, it was a conversion from 17. This one's really nice. This is a really nice mod. I like it. I like using it. And just like that, that field is finished. <laughs> Look at the, just knocking them out. We'll go do field 134. Then we have field 19 left. Then I can send them an invoice. I love his farm. I really do. I like this little farm down here in the corner. It's one of my uh, one of my preferred areas here on the map. I really like it here. I also like this area here. I'll pull up the map and show you. Um, where's it? I kind of like it up here, just because this is it. It goes up a hill because this is up on top of like a on top of a hill and then everything kind of slopes down to the river this is a really nice little area too a lot of great little areas but this with the ponds this is just very nicely done I can see why he picked it I, really do. I can clearly see why uh, where are we going field 134 I think there's a gate down here there is let's narrow up our wheels I'm still learning everybody's farms the, t the tough part about being a contractor is, is I, I, I don't have my own farm. I have to learn everyone else's farms. Oh, this is his grass field. One of his grass fields. Oop. One of his hay, hay, oh yeah, he planted this in grass. Ah. Fancy. Very, very fancy see how long we might get lucky we might be able to squeeze in all these fields with one tank I'm gonna say we're not gonna be able to we'll just go ahead and close that for now just to be good stewards of his property because he is watching I'm sure he's watching me I gotta zoom way out because these uh, grass fields are kind of kind of tough to keep track of we really don't need GPS all the fields are so oddly shaped that we really don't need GPS for these just kind of knock them out you know it's not too not too bad not too hard but yeah I hope everybody's doing well let me know what you're up to in the comments tell me how life is treating you how are things doing uh, I don't I my release schedules all messed up I couldn't even tell you I think if you're watching this it's like on a Monday or Wednesday or something oh Again, I don't know why. Every now and then, like, I go to steer, and it really oversteers. Oversteers really, really far. Now, we're going to need more fertilizer. We're not going to be able to do this. Field, his field 19. We have field 19 left to do. It's one of the biggest ones still. So we're going to run out of fertilizer here. Hmm. What to do, what to do, right? Let us figure out. Let's think. See, right now is where this the mod where you can control your nozzles would be really useful because I have this little strip here. And again, to be a good steward, you know, because he's paying me to be efficient. If it was just me, I would just make another run right up the middle, but I'm trying to minimize fertilizer usage. Trying to be a trying to be a good employee contractor to the farm it's 
So we'll do this little dance here, the little up and down dance. Trying to get all these areas sprayed. Oh, we're so close. I don't, like I said, I, I don't think we're going to be able to finish that field 19. We might need just a little tank. I'll try, I'm going to try that little 5,000 liter tank. We'll pull it behind the Ford, the pickup truck, and see see if we can go get some fertilizer. I'm going to try it. I don't know if it's going to work. In some live testing here. Using some stuff I haven't really used much in game. Some different mods and things, so. Can we get out of here? We have to go back. Yeah, we can get out this way right here. All right, so that is all these fields are finished now. 134, 35, 36, 37, 39. Like I said, it doesn't, in his order, there's nothing about 132. Let me double check. No. Fields 19, 134 to 137, and field 139. So I'm thinking he probably forgot about that, or he's going to do it himself. Which very well may be the case. Is the wire there? No, it's unhooked. We'll put it back when we're done. Let's, all right, I'm going to run up to field 19, and we'll see if we can uh we can get this field done i'll be right back all right we are back up on field 19 i don't we might get close We're, we might get close we may not need any fertilizer i also forgot he has a whole big tank full of fertilizer i delivered a load of liquid fertilizer down here to him so we may not need to um we may not need to go buy anymore and then he has to I mean he already owns it so that's not I probably should have used his um, probably should use his fertilizer earlier to be honest with you I didn't even think about it raise our boom so we're not dragging the ground here there we go yeah we'll see if we can make this happen a little in cap work let's try a little in cap work don't do much in cab stuff I need to I don't even have my wheel hooked up today <laughs> you know what we may make it it's gonna be really close we might have to get a little squirt a little squirt of something from up there on his uh, from up there at his yard we'll see hmm. joys of, of narrows we can just drive through fields and never have to worry about damaging anything Thank you, Farm Sim. Ah, <laughs> uh, yeah, we'll, we'll need to go grab a little squirt or something from his uh, from his area. Why is my? There we go. Just felt like it was a little, a little narrow. These fields, on you know, on the mini map, the fields are a little tiny size, and then on the big map. Or in, in life, these are actually much bigger because it's a 4x map. Oh, I just ran right into the fence. <laughs> oh man, can I can I charge him for equipment uh, equipment repairs and stuff? Probably not. Probably not going to be able to get away with that. It's so hard to work in cab because it just I don't I just don't ever do it so I'm just not used to it you know but the cab view on this model is awesome it really is it's such a great mod the mirrors are working well that mirror is working some of the mirrors are working some of them aren't yeah we're gonna have to go get a little squirt of fertilizer out of his out of his tank And then anything that's remaining, we'll have to pay him. We'll have to rebate him, if that makes sense. Move, track, move. Har oh. Harvester, sprayer. Oh my gosh, my brain's broken. Let's fold up. Oh, we, we, we got really close. 
Really close. We just need a little bit. I'm going to say a thousand liters. We'll, we'll, we'll go use his tank real quick. And like I said, anything that's... So we use 4,712 liters at $1.20 a liter. So he has to pay for that. And I have to figure out the acreage. The total acreage that we sprayed. Which I can use. I have to jump around to each field. And check his field info. Because it, we can't look up our statistics in multiplayer, which is something I hate. I just wish the game was would track numbers a little better. Here's his little setup here. Oh man, he's already making silage and everything. He's been busy. Let's see how much fur he's got in here. Oh yeah, he's got tons. He won't mind. <laughs> it's less he's gonna have to pay for. So it's. We'll buy it. We'll buy a couple thousand liters from them. We'll pull out a couple thousand. We'll finish finish this spray job, and this this task will be completed. I'm hoping I get some other other work from people. Like I said, I got a animal uh, animal transport contract coming up that I'll be doing. We'll be doing the animal transport contract probably in the next video. And then, um, after that, that's all the work I got lined up. It's just a couple jobs by farmer client. I can, I can go into the map and do a bunch of work. Like, there's a bunch of jobs here. So if I run out of work with, with the team, I might do one. I might do, like, a video montage of job assignments. But I'm really wanting to do work for each, each farm. So I think that's kind of fun and different. And we can kind of watch together as everybody's farm kind of grows. It's just the pace is, is way different than I'm used to. 24 day seasons. Because there's, you know, I know like once, once you get something done, right? You got a, who's blue? Is that red dirt? Yeah, you got red dirt over here. I mean, his little farm's squared away right now. Like, I think he's waiting to plant corn. That's all he's got to do. So there's really not a whole lot they can do other than wait. And, uh, which is fun because it, it just makes the whole session chill. You know, you're not in such a hurry to, to get the work done. If that makes sense. Alrighty. That's done. We got a little chunk right here we need to spray. He's got a lot of hay. A lot of grass fields. I wonder how many cows he plans on. I need. I didn't get to watch his stream over the weekend, or the last time he was on here. Uh, I was starting to, and then I got busy at work, so these things happen. It's so close to being done. So close. And then what I'll do is I'll uh, I'll cut away. And I'll calculate up the final numbers, and I'll post a shot of the invoice at the end, so you guys can see kind of kind of how I do it. Like I said, I'm charging. It's a dollar twenty. Um, it's a dollar twenty per liter for the for the fert for the liquid fertilizer. Is a dollar thirty five? I can't remember. I think it's a sorry. It's a dollar thirty five per liter for the for the fertilizer and then it's a hundred bucks per acre to spray it unless they supply their own which he really kind of did i just forgot that he had that tanker full of it so i might i might have to i might have to eat the fertilizer costs if he wants me to all right that's it so i owe him back for 1512 liters of fertilizer that i owe him so I, I need to pay him a dollar thirty-five for that. But actually, so we used forty-seven twelve plus four hundred. So we we used around fifty-one hundred liters of fur. But then I borrowed some of his. So yeah, I'll get the contract worked out. But yeah, that's it. That's this contract completed. All fields fertilized. Like I said, one thirty-two needs fur, but it wasn't in the list, so I'm not going to do it. I can't. I, you know he's. He's probably working right now because it's the middle of the day when I'm doing this. 
yeah, I think I think what we're gonna do is I'm gonna jump away. I'm gonna get back to the shop in the office. I'll make up an invoice real quick, and I'll show you that. And I'll talk to you then. See you in just a second. Let's make us up some coffee and and a burrito. Click. All right. All righty. Yeah, we're just back here at the shop figuring up our final tally. Now, if I would have done that contract right in the fact that I would have used Farmer Klein's fertilizer that he already had, I would only charged him $3,440 because he had 34.4 acres that I sprayed, which uh, 100 bucks per acre is $34.40. And then I actually would have uh, owed him $2,041.20 because I had $1,500 or 1,500 liters of his fertilizer still in my sprayer. So really it comes out to I would have only made $1,400 off that contract. And in fact, that's all I'm going to bill him, $1,400 and some change because I shouldn't have bought fertilizer before I went down to spray his farm. That was my first mistake. I really shouldn't have bought fertilizer before I went down there to spray his his farm. So, yep, he's only going to get a bill for $1,400. Uh, so that's a deal for him. Next time I'll remember he actually has fertilizer on his farm that we can use to do the contract for him so that he doesn't have to keep paying for fertilizer. Um, but that's okay. I mean, I still got $911,000 in the bank. This playthrough really has not much to do with money. I need to turn the blinkers off. I just parked in here. It's, it's really more about just, you know, having a good time, hanging out and doing something fun. So that's kind of, kind of the plan with this, this whole series is doing that. Like I said, I have another job lined up today that we'll be having to get to. And you guys will be able to enjoy that in the next episode. It's going to involve this trailer right here. So stay tuned to the channel for that. Thank you so very much for tuning in. I hope you enjoyed today's episode. I had a lot of fun making it like I always do. Thank you guys so very much for hanging out. I really, really do appreciate it. Until next time, stay safe. Thanks for watching. See you later. Bye.